There is exciting news for hockey fans this evening. It has officially been announced that the Utica Comets are partnering with our sister station WPNY to broadcast all home games this season. Our reporter uh, or sports director David Edelstein, he also reports. He's live in the studio with details about when, where and how you can watch. David. Well, Thomas, a lot to report here tonight. Utica Comets 16 home games plus any potential home playoff games this season are set to air on our sister station WPNY. And if you have an antenna, that's just one channel up from the one you're watching right now. Channel 20.2 on cable. It's channel 12. The American Hockey League season begins this Friday and the first game you can catch on WPNY is the Comets home opener on Wednesday, February 17th when Utica hosts rival Syracuse Crunch. Utica Comets team president Rob Esch says this partnership benefits the team and the fans. This year, um, you know, with the announcement of partnering up with WUTR and doing a pregame show, intermission shows, uh, player profiles, things like that, and having everything on cable television um, for us is the first time ever. Uh, I think it allows our brand to expand during a time that, you know, is obviously very tough and challenging for people to get into the building. And if we can take their minds away from, uh, you know, the day-to-day -day, uh, things that we go through right now, you know, I think that's great. WPNY General Manager Steve Ventura said today that in the Comets announcement, quote, unique situations create unique opportunities. The pandemic has put us all in an unusual place and our community strives to get back to normal. We see this partnership with the Comets as a step in that direction. Thomas. And David, just a couple questions. Fans in Herkimer County, uh, uh, Tsego County, and the Utica area of Oneida County will be able uh, to watch these games on uh, WPNY. But what other plans do the Comets have for the broadcasts this year in addition to showing the game? Yeah, along with the main show, which of course is the hockey game itself, Esh mentioned those extra features there, a pregame and postgame show, as well as intermission reports. He says there's a plan to hear from some local Comets reporters and analysts on those broadcasts and also have feature stories that allow fans to get to know the Comets players better from both the Canucks and the Blues organizations this year. And half of the Comets 32 games this season will be on WPNY, but where might fans be able to follow the away broadcasts? Every AHL team controls its own home broadcast, so that's actually why the Comets home games will be on WPNY. The away games, though, are managed by the teams that the Comets will be visiting. Those broadcasts can be found on the AHL TV streaming service, which Esh says that all Comets uh, season ticket holders are getting free access to this year. And, uh, you know, while this is a great opportunity to watch Comets games live on TV, what indication did Esh give about if fans could be allowed in games this, uh, in person this season? And if so, when would that be? Well, Esh says it's unknown right now. Uh, it's well known, rather, around the league that the Utica Comets make a home atmosphere that's pretty hard to beat. Players on the Comets and even opponents have told us that they love the crowd when they're at the Adirondack Bank Center. Something that Comets forward Cole Lind has said is he's missed this past Saturday when he scored two of Utica's seven goals is that he screamed the horn went off, but there was odd to not hear any of the crowd. So as says that the Comets do hope to allow at least a limited number of fans at some point later this season. He says the team and arena staff are prepared to do that safely. And as says that's why the Comets actually scheduled most of their home games for the second half of the season, hoping that they'll be able to have some fans back in the building by then. Well, David, thank you for that update. It's crazy to think just almost two years ago, uh, David and I were fairly green and we were here uh, early on in our careers with WTR and we opened uh, from the odd, uh, I think during summer when they had their home opener. Crazy to think where we are right now. Be sure to get our CNY homepage app so you can stay up to date with all the latest local news. Before we go to break, here's a preview of your weather with our chief meteorologist, Colin Hill. Finally, one round of snow is ending. We'll see a nice quiet day tomorrow, but another is on the way for Friday. Details next.